This week, I'm going to do some work experience with a video production company called MWS Media. Here, I'm going to learn a bit about using filmmaking skills in the real world and how everything works in a professional company. Throughout the week, I'm going to do some filming to document what I do on each day. On Tuesday, I arrived at MWS where I was shown around the building and saw the studio, the editing rooms and the sound studio amongst other places. My first task was to do some research and come up with some ideas for a pitch video for a company called Beaverswood. This was very fun and I learned a bit about how companies approach media companies to make videos for them and how that whole process works. Afterwards, I got started on tackling a camera problem as we had found dust mites in the lenses of one of the cameras. After a bit of research, I cleaned out the camera bags and started to try and find a solution to the problem. On Wednesday, I carried on trying to overcome the dust mite problem. I finished cleaning out the bags and then I called up Canon to find out how we can send the cameras back. Then I did a bit of research on film festivals to enter one of MWS's latest films. Next, I went into the studio and we started filming the pitch for Beaverswood. This was great. I got to learn a lot about advanced camera techniques like white balancing, and I got to help out in the production of the pitch. The experts in warehouse identification and label products. We've come a long way in over 30 years of designing, manufacturing and supplying the best labelling products on the market. On Thursday, I started writing the script for the voiceover of my documentary, the one you're watching now. Afterwards, I did some audio recording in the sound studio with Phil, the audio you are listening to right now. I gained lots of experience from this, as I had not been very skilled with sound to start with, but now I have a better idea on how to record voiceovers and general sound in films. In the afternoon, I started editing a first draft of the documentary to show Ben, Phil and Nick, to get some tips and an idea of areas that I can improve upon. On Friday, I finished filming and editing the documentary. I filmed the interviews, the introduction, and the ending in front of the studio's white background. By doing this, I learned a lot about interviewing and syncing audio with video. I then edited this with some extra voice recording. So having Mark here this week has been really useful. Um, obviously, whenever somebody has a certain amount of knowledge and a certain amount of enthusiasm for what we do here, um, it's a lot easier to integrate them and, and give them not just a really useful period of work experience, but actually then be useful to us as well. That's kind of the ideal um, work placement for us. He's very keen to learn uh, about film and video industry in general and what it's been like to uh, what it's like to work uh, within a company uh, a small setup like ours on a day-to-day -day basis um, it's always good when someone's very keen obviously uh, and enthusiastic um, Mark has um, done some filmmaking before we've met him while making a, a short film here before uh, so we know that he can do certain things such as putting together this video which is a really useful exercise for him but also something that um, that we can use to show what we do um, from the opinion of someone from the outside, which is really helpful. To, he's very interested in video and audio and understands it from the word go, so that's good. He's always like, he's one or two stages higher uh, up, if you like, than the average work experience person who's just coming here to, to see what it's like and see if they might be interested. So Mark has done well enough this week that we've invited him to come back, um, dates permitting and time permitting, to come and actually work um, on location with us with, um, with some of our clients. I really enjoyed my time at MWS. I learned a lot about how everything works in a professional video and media company and gained lots of skills that I can use in my current filmmaking. I'm looking forward to coming back in a few months to uh, gain some more experience and skills in film and in the real world.